Shoot her. Shoot her, definitely. Oh, man. Look at that deer. Boy, he's wind checking and everything. When this big buck stepped out, I was pumped. But I've missed two deer in two days. I absolutely don't want to make it three. Folks, he better not make it three misses in two days, or I'm just going to keep hunting with his dad. It's a good deer. I got to get those trees cleared. As soon as he clears those trees, I'm going to take them. This big buck came out to our left. I just need him to get a little bit more to the right to have a clear shot. He starts wind checking like crazy. I'm thinking, what else can go wrong? He's cleared. As soon as he clears those trees, I'm going to take them. Right there, right there. Look at that deer. Boy, he's wind checking and everything. There he goes. That's a good hit. I put a good hit on that deer. There he goes. He's circling around. Come on, go down, go down. Yes! That is a really good Texas whitetail. I think that, uh, I'm, I'm shaking a little bit here, but that kind of makes up for the last two days of mishaps for me. Come on, that is a really good deer right there. Let's go to him. You know, there's a, a lot of reasons to travel out of your home state to, to deer hunt, to turkey hunt, to do whatever kind of hunting. And laying up here is one of the biggest reasons I come to Texas. I'm not sure exactly how big he is, but I know he has got a ton of character. And I can see it already. Man, look at this deer. Look at the character on this deer. God, man. We have had just a tremendous two or three days here in Texas. Some good luck, some bad luck. Tonight was good luck. The last two days I've missed two deer rattling them in. And I'm not too proud to say that one of them was strictly buck fever as you see the dirt explode at his feet. But this deer, they've been seeing these big deer work these big thick edges like this. And we just got on a deer trail. And there's a really good trail that runs right through here. We've seen some good rubs. And we set up on the, on the edges of these clearings like this, past that smaller deer up today. There was three or four that went through early. They were scooting right on through. When he came out, we didn't, we didn't catch it right off the bat, but he was wind checking. He was being real careful. He didn't grow all this character to get all this big by not doing a bunch of wind checking before he starts moving out to where he's going to feed. Awesome, awesome deer. What a week in Texas.